WNZ uh, Round 3 Tauranga. Not only is this my favourite track of the series, last year it had the biggest crowd at the time of the year. Uh, you know, we're peak summer now. That's what also makes this event definitely the best of the, the season just because of that, the atmosphere it creates, the time of the year, the amount of people, and the, the track itself. It's so coming out of a win from Whangarei. It's had a good time to actually prep the car. I mean, round one and round two has been kind of a rush with that car because the Bad Boy RX-8 hasn't been ready. Um, the unfortunate thing with Tauranga is the strict noise restrictions. We have 95 decibels as the maximum. Well, with a naturally aspirated setup and rotary itself is definitely quite a challenge. Uh, so a lot more mufflers are put in, um, which we lose performance. What you lose in power you can gain with momentum I guess by uh, just simple things. Your alignment and tyre pressures, I guess the way I look at it is find the limit and then work back from there. You know? A lot of people will start off 80% and they may never find that edge. second, third, fourth, as fast as I can. There's like a, it's hard to tell by looking at it, but when you're in the car, the whole car feels like it's airborne. But for me, I kind of just back off the gas, maybe 5%, just enough to be able to flip the throttle, and it'll kind of like launch the car, it'll make it squat. I can kind of launch off it, which will throw me straight, and then use the power to be able to gauge and sweep around with the angle to be able to brush exactly like right where the judge's tower is to be able to come in there nice, smooth, try not to use any handbrake and just use the power of the car. And obviously the, the longer you're on the gas, we go from that all the way around to another outside clip. From that outside clip there's another actual transition, it drops down. Um, we find a lot of grip comes out of the car again because it's just the weight of cars coming off all the rubber. Then you come from that outside clip right across the whole track into this wall right here. Definitely my style track. So one thing with a track that is all outside clip, it's easy for the chase car to close that proximity and get it get in tight by shallowing up or not running the wide line which is out. A bit of cocky I guess straight out. It's Definitely felt pretty confident even after the first lap. The second lap probably took it a little bit too hard, but um, not a major crash, just brushed the wall probably a little bit harder than I wanted, folded the exhaust around, so um, the guys can take the exhaust off and smash that back out, get it round again, and um, bent the rear tube frame and stuff, but the way TBR is, it's just a Mike's quotas stick it to the wall and uh, he's trying to stick it to half the exhaust to the wall, so. So we can get it off now, it's crushed one of the VNZs, so uh, that affects the power. Uh, we can't have any restrictions in the exhaust system, so uh, we'll get it off and get it straightened up. Get it back on, get back out there.
sick battle with Vanger, knew about it, just really pushed hard and you know he's got clean line I guess notice with the RX7 just had so much forward grip we were able to stay on him and went one more time and man I didn't think I'd get any closer the second round went push oh super hard man as um it was, uh, felt good for my seat anyway. I guess uh, the crowd really liked it and went through the finals of Andrew Redwood and just uh, we had a good lead run. Andrew is uh, a little bit shallow, we had an advantage and then just a rookie error uh, coming down the first straight. It's uh, you know we came sort of four gear changes before the initiation and uh, just missed the gear and that was enough for Andrew to grab uh, two car links on me and then you know for me to be able to close it and put me back up. Uh, just too hard a task with the, the amount of grip from his car and with two car legs, um, just couldn't pull him back in but you know obviously congratulations to Redwood. Next round, Talpo. Another wicked track. Yeah. 